Take what he did today on the grounds that it distracts from the agenda or it was a tactical mistake, I believe, is a cop-out. What Trump did today was a moral disgrace. What he did is he reverted back to where he was on Saturday and made it very clear that what he read on Sunday, was it Monday, two days later? Monday. Was a hostage tape, clearly reading off a prompter, saying these denunciations name of the KKK, etc. That wasn't Trump speaking, that was the aide speaking. The reason it's a moral disgrace is this. This generation, for the last 50, 60 years, all the modern presidents, you know, you can go all the way back, you can say Woodrow Wilson was exempt, but beyond that, understood there was something unique about the history of slavery and racism in this country, that we had to cure this original sin. It was not cured by the Civil War as Lincoln had hoped, because it was followed by a hundred years of state-sponsored oppression. It began to be cured with civil rights, equality of rights, and this generation, the last 50 or so years, has done a splendid job in redeeming itself. What Trump is missing here is the uniqueness of white supremacy, KKK, and Nazism. Yes, there were bad guys on both sides, that's not the point. This was instigated, instituted. The riot began over a Nazi riot, a Nazi rally. And the, and the only killing here occurred by one of the, the pro-Nazi, pro-KKK people. But if you're, if you're looking for nuance from this president, he's not going to give you nuance. He's not.